Okay, so with kids heading back to school, they might come home with some new slang that maybe not everyone knows. You heard that woman just say, I have no idea. So to help you understand, 7 News reporter Kristen Moran spoke with some resident experts. Hi, my name is Brian Krupe and I'm 17 years old. Hi, my name is Allie, I'm 12. Hi, my name is Jackson and I am 9 years old. Hi, my name is Taylor Krupe and I'm 14 years old. What year were you born in? 2015. All right, we're gonna go down the list right here. All these Gen Z, Gen Alpha lingo where it's feeling confident. Yeah. You feel like it's bussin'. <laughs> feeling skibbity. Now I'm feeling sigma. Okay, yeah. It's like short for charismatic. Can you use it in a sentence? That kid has a lot of riz. Being able for people to like you and to look good. Or like the, it's like the ability to pick up girls. So you use it more with guys. Yeah. Like that guy has got a yeah. lot of riz. Yeah. Like he's with a lot of girls and he's hanging out and yeah. you're like, oh, he's got riz. Yeah. If you were saying it in like a negative way to someone, you would say you have L riz. And if you're just <laughs> new, I didn't know this was a thing, L riz. Yeah, L riz is like, like not good. It's like weird. You're weird. <laughs> what are you doing with your life? Ohio's like also like that because it's like questionable and like, you know. Why Ohio? Like, what I did Ohio no do to anyone? I have no clue. <laughs> Don't drive through, it's just bad. What goes down in Ohio stays in Ohio. How would you use that in a sentence? It's just gonna be toilet in Ohio. <laughs> Wait, which is even worse than just normal skin. Wait, what? <laughs> You're skipping toilet, like you're not, like you're back, like that's Gross. not it. You're not it. It's better than beta, but still pretty mid. I just, eh. Okay. It's like just defining your jawline. Tomorrow, like. Wait, I would need you to look at the camera and mute for me. <laughs> but what is that action? <laughs> It's basically like, come over here, BBG. You like kind of like put your tongue to the roof of your mouth and like suck in. So am I mewing? <laughs> <laughs> Was that it? I guess. Words that aren't cool. Okay. Slay. Yeah, I just I don't I don't really use that. Uh, <laughs> no one really uses that anymore. Really, oh I don't know. <laughs> Ed and Katie are gonna hate to hear that. <laughs> okay, new one. Extra bonus here, what's zesty? It's basically like something super clean, super nice, that just zesty. Well, thank you, this is awesome, and I feel like I'm not cool anymore. <laughs> that was buzzing. <laughs> thank you so much for this, this was so fun, translating all these words with you. Okay, period. Do you guys say period still? No. <laughs> you don't what say like that? period. What is that? <laughs> Got the cameras, got the cameras. I gotta tell you, this story had me crying. Um, Ed loves to say slay and think he, that he's, he thinks he's so cool when he says it. <laughs> he watched it before and he was so devastated to learn that nobody says that anymore. Also, Jackson, hilarious. hilarious. <laughs> he goes, call me. I was dying, he's nine years old, so funny. They were so funny. <laughs> Thank and, you, you know, to well, all the kids for doing this for yeah. us and helping us aging people through this. Oh, yeah, I feel for Kristen because she's like, oh, I don't know the lingo anymore. Listen, I don't know, I mean, half the time I'm like, can you translate exactly what you just said to me? Okay. Okay. Oh, that was fantastic. So there you go. If your kids are going home with some of these new words, now you got a better handle on them this morning.